What up guys, Dan here again for Chase the Dream, bringing you back another haul video. Um, I went to two different thrift stores today that were half off in my local area. Uh, it's been a combined $70 at the two, that's a lot, but i uh, got a lot of good stuff and I'm going to show you. Um, start with shoes, got a pair of uh, Youth Nike Hyper Venom. Uh, the lowest uh, price on eBay for these are forty dollars. I paid four. You can see that seven ninety nine half off. Paid four. Got a pair of Vans. So Minnie Mouse on them. I also they were seven ninety nine. I paid four. Uh, lowest I saw on eBay was thirty. Picked up these shoes. Not a whole 100% uh, sure on these, but uh, by a brand called ANA. Anna. Um, nice little floral pattern, wedge, open toe here. Um, I did pay five for these, um, but I'm thinking I can get $20, $25 for these. That was the shoes. Um, I picked up two neckties. Uh, they were a dollar a piece. Um, one is uh, Looney Tunes with money on it, and the other it's like wine bottles, things like that. Um, figure eight dollars each for the ties. Uh, picked up some scrub tops. Scrub tops sell really good. Um, I got three pairs, figure, sell them $10 each. Here's the first pair, nice little floral. Just adding it to inventory, add it to inventory. There's another one, a little paisley print on it. And uh, this one, I didn't really like the pattern, but uh, it's like, Really colorful flowers, but it is a size 3XL. So, figure $10 each on them. $30 for all of them. I mean, I'm going to list them higher, but uh, with the best offer, it's average 10. Um, let's see here. Alright, here is a Chico's. Chico shirt, I paid $2.50, it's half off. Nice little Paisley design. I've been told Paisley's hot, I don't know, but long sleeve, figure 15 for it. Got some pants here, the first time I've ever seen these, but uh, these are Zenergy by Chico's. Um... They are like athletic wear, capris, really lightweight. You have uh, little cargo pockets here. Really, really nice. Uh, lightweight, so I'll be able to ship them uh, first class. I paid $2.50 after half off. We'll just uh, figure 15 on them. Uh, here is a pair of puzzle jeans. I've never heard of this brand. But uh, light, dark wash, some nice graphics on the back there. It was a very small size. Uh, these are very light as well. I might be able to get them first class as well. So we'll figure 15 for these. If I take a little less, I'll be all right. Um, there's a pair of Victoria's Secret pink jeans i didn't know victoria's secret made jeans but they do i paid three dollars for them and uh yeah these guys are going for around 20 bucks a piece for them this was one of the better scores this is a ralph lauren pair of jeans women's jeans the unique part is all of this like indian beading um across it I found three sold listings on eBay currently. 
uh, one for 35, one for 50, and one for like $75. So I'm going to figure 35 is the minimum, and we'll go from there. This right here, this is a youth Harley Davidson uh, jacket. Um, I paid $2 for it. Really good find when you figure that I pay more for shirts. So, $2 for this uh, Harley Davidson jacket. Um, there are actually not a whole lot of youth Harley Davidson jackets to compare to on eBay. Um, but the lowest one I saw was 30 so we'll figure $30 for that. Let me get a little better organized here. Alright, got some t-shirts here. This is a uh, San Francisco Giant Buster Posey. He's a pretty good baseball player. One MVP a couple times, so um, we'll figure 10 on him. This is a uh, Harley Davidson t-shirt. Cool little graphics on that. Figure 10. 10 on him, 10 on him. Uh, this is a uh, Express Jeans uh, t-shirt. Pretty nice there. Pretty much paid uh, either a dollar fifty or two dollars for all these T-shirts, but uh, this Express figure ten. Um, this uh, video game shirt, it's Kingdom Hearts. It's pretty big size. Figure ten. And this right here, uh, the band Chicago, it is their USA tour from 2013. I'm going to figure 12. Um, I only saw two listings. Uh, one was for 14, one was for 16. Uh, they were sold, but they had best offers, so I'm not exactly sure. So we'll figure out 12. Uh, I'll probably list it for 16, but we'll see. Some more shirts here. Got a uh, Banana Republic. Oh, shirt. It's a Banana Republic. Uh, it's a slim fit, which is very in style right now. Striped Banana Republic, size large. Um, they wanted seven ninety nine for it. Half off would have made it four, and I couldn't figure out why um, until I looked a little deeper. And this is actually. Still have the tag on it. Um, so I figure with it being new in tags, 25 for it. Got uh, Tommy Bahama, short sleeve, uh, button front, figure 12. And this is a shirt by Vintage Silk. It's like a Hawaiian, Hawaiian style shirt. Here it's by Vintage Silk. It's 100% silk. I paid a dollar fifty. We'll just say it sells for ten bucks. All right, let's go with some pants. This is just a uh, regular pair of men's uh, Levi's 505. Um, it's a pretty decent size. For them, um, I paid. I did pay four dollars for them, but uh, men's jeans, especially Levi's, usually don't go for anything less than twenty dollars. So, figure twenty on them. Uh, here's a pair of uh, Hollister Hollister shorts, uh, cargo shorts. There, I paid two dollars and fifty cents. Um, I'm gonna figure twenty. Um, I did sell a pair of these probably about two months ago, and I sold them for like 24 but um, it was the summer, it's winter now, so we'll figure 20. 
it's a pair of uh, Cabela's Seven Pocket Hiker uh, shorts. Um, I paid two dollars for these. Nothing really special about them. There's no graphics on them or anything like that. Um, what you would expect from Cabela's. I mean, it's outdoors wear. So this is hiking, hiking shorts, things like that. This is the reason which uh, made me really like it. Look at that. This is a size 48. I'm a big guy. This would be huge on me. Um, so figure $20 on those. Here's something I took a little bit of a chance on, um, but uh, I paid $2. This is a brand, Bazala and Lesna. Never heard of it. Um, it's an Italian brand. It's made in Italy. But uh, these pants are 100% wool corduroy. You can see that. They're pretty decent condition. So, um, you no, know, this is a higher end... Uh, it's not like the super popular higher end brand, but um, figure 25 for these. This is a pair of uh, Brooks Brothers wool dress pants. Pretty, pretty nice here. Um, not exactly sure what size this is. I have to do the measurements on it. There might be a tag in here somewhere that says what they're supposed to be. I don't know. But uh, look them up. It's $25. Them. It's a pair of uh, Banana Republic. Uh, it's like a dark khaki pants. Banana Republic, right there. Uh, figure $20 on those pants. I just sold a pair of Banana Republic corduroy pants for uh, 28 last week, so if we can get that, that'd be great. Uh, speaking of corduroys, got a pair of Lucky Brand, these are 361 vintage straight uh, corduroy pants. Uh, right there. Maybe 20 bucks for them. Like I said, I'm quoting everything low. You know, I'm going to list these for more than 20, but. I put a best offer on everything, so we'll see what we get. And um, I did pick up one thing that was not clothing, and that is this American Heart Association CPR anatomy thingy. Um, see the picture, it actually shows you how to do CPR. It has these little dummies on there, and the dummies were still wrapped inside, so they've never been used. Um, I paid $1.50 for it. And uh, they're going for about 20. So uh, adding all that in together, that was a $545 in sales. I paid 70. Uh, figure after fees, that left me with about $470. Uh, shipping cost to probably take up about 100 of that. So that puts me down at 379, so minus the 70. So about $300 in uh, profits on, I spent about three hours total with uh, driving between the two stores and actually shopping. So it was pretty good. Um, I'm really trying to focus on some higher end stuff, um, looking at pants, I'm watching a lot of different YouTube videos. It's the best thing I can suggest for any of you to do, watch different guys, see what they're doing. Um, give you a couple suggestions, man. Rockstar Flipper, watch him. Does great with uh, clothing. I like raking profits. Uh, touches on a lot of things. Clothing's good. Uh, if you're looking at women's clothing, I've learned a lot from Nicole State. So watch her as well. Um, and there's tons of other ones. Treasure Gnome, Reezy Resale. Um, I like uh, Pittsburgh Mike. He didn't do a lot of videos, but uh, he's in a lot of uh, comment sections and live videos. So. If you ever get a chance to watch someone's live video on reselling, Pittsburgh Mike's new, normally there. So uh, check him out and uh, check the rest of those guys out. But that's a quick video there for you. Um, until next time, have a good day.